Hi, I'm Tony Fleming and welcome to Fleming's Ultimate Garage. I like this LS3 Camaro, Trey. How do I like it? Are you kidding me? I love it. Anyway, thanks for joining us on today's video. 68 Pro Touring Camaro. Listen, man, they are cars that are a wide range of pricing on there, and you need to know why that is. You say, Tone, well, I see some of these cars for this. I see some of these cars for this. Tell me why your car is this. It looks great, but why is it so expensive, right? Well, it's actually not expensive, and I'll tell you why. Because to build this car costs roughly $40,000 more, 40000 more than it's right now. You say, well, how can you sell it for that price? Well, the person that built this car, we bought it from them after they drove it for a little bit, and you get to benefit from that. But let's talk about the components that make for a great car. Underneath the hood here, we're talking about you could get an LS1 drivetrain if you wanted to save some money, right? And uh, that's still a great engine, but this is the LS3 GM performance parts engine. The LS1 having 350 horsepower, this having 500 horsepower, upgraded cam and heads. It is a big, big difference. Let me just tell you, the fact that it's all aluminum and the transmission's aluminum as well, saves a lot of weight when you're talking about how it handles. Throw in the upgraded disc brakes that are all the way around. It's got Willwood cross-drilled rotors and big calipers all the way around and staggered 18-inch uh, bond speed alloys. Forget the fact that they're staggered, but the simple fact is the tire itself is 100% wider than the original factory tire that came on this car, not to mention their high-speed radials. It handles like a dream, all right? Let's talk about paint for a second, because paint's the most important, because that's what you're going to walk up to every day in your garage. You're going to go to a car show, something like that, and you want to be able to see uh, how great it looks. And let's go ahead and see what that looks like right here on the camera. Should be able to read all of the letters nice and clear. And the detail of it, this is a custom hood, too, with the vents put in there. Did you guys see that? I want to make sure you saw that. All right. This stripe, for instance, right here, this is not a decal. You can't even feel it. It's been clear coated over. You say, well, Tom, that sounds great. That doesn't really sound like a big deal. Well, you're right. It's not a big deal, but it's another extra step. And that gives you an idea of why some cars are nicer build cars than others. One of the things that, that makes for a car a better looking car is the RS front end with the hideaway headlight doors. These modern emblems that we made and go ahead and installed in there. We also have a brand new spoiler. We chipped the spoiler pulling in here. We have a brand new one to put it on. But I like to point that out so you can see that not everything is perfect that we have here, and we, but we know how to make it that way. Anyway, uh, let's move on to the rest of the car. We'll check it out. Let's take a peek underneath here because underneath here, although you may not care and you may never see it, this is why a car drives better than other cars. When the detail is spent underneath the car, that's when you get the nice ride quality, the rattle free. Uh, riding, the quick handling, those kinds of things, the stopping, the braking, that's what you get. Throw in the fact that this has the RS hideaway headlight, it's completed with the RS backup lights down here where a regular Camaro would have the backup lights right in here. This billet cap is very nice, front and rear spoilers, right? So these are all the things when you say, well, that's a great looking car, uh, you don't really notice why. This is why all these little touches, these modern emblems, right? Let's take a peek inside the trunk for a second and you can see one more step that goes even farther. The battery's been moved out of there. This is a 45 pound mass that's been moved to the back of the car, balancing the car a little bit better. A custom carpet made for the painted trunk. All these cool decals inside here. If you went to a car show or something like that, you'd be proud to open this up and show it off. I just want to talk about this custom hood for a second. Look at this nice little touch. It's all these little things that make for 
uh, a great looking car. And when we get inside, you're gonna see some of that too. But right now, we're gonna look at the motivation. And this, my friend, is where we go to the next level. You go to a car show with this, this is beautiful. We had this custom made uh, carbon fiber cover made here. Uh, cold, modern, air conditioning and heat, right? Big electric uh, fans on this radiator. This radiator is 100% bigger than the original factory style radiator in the car so that you can go to the beach in there, have the AC on, have another couple or the kids in the car, right, with the windows up and enjoy this car because it, it's, it's exactly what it is. It's, it's so beautiful on the outside, but it has all the modern components of today to make the drivability so much better. There's custom suspension in here uh, and all of the good stuff. You can see like everything is new. All right, come join me in here and you're gonna see why. This, my friend, is a fabulous interior, all right? Check this out. First off, I want you to hear that. Listen, that is a serious door. Somebody spent days on that door making it close and open properly. All right, so these are upgraded custom bucket seats, so they hold you in place a lot better. It's not sliding around. This custom console, six-speed shifter, upgraded digital sound system here. Here's the air conditioning and heating controls with the vents all there. Custom dash as well with 140 mile an hour speedometer, 8,000 RPM tack, and full gauges below there as well. This three spoke wheel is a dynamite. Let me just go ahead and straighten it up. All right, there we go. Looks perfect. Uh, the back seat, plenty of room there for kids or another couple. I have the seat slid all the way back, I almost can't even reach the pedals. Um, billet pedals down here, billet mirror, billet window cranks. I mean, just these little touches. It's, it's why I say to you, you need to see all of the detail of a car so you can appreciate the effort that goes into it so you know what you're getting when you do get it. All right, so we're closing up the video on one of the best Camaros we've ever had. The underneath is beautifully detailed. All of it's fresh and new. Uh, the drivetrain is fabulously new. The way it drives is fabulously new. The outside of it is not fabulously new. As far as style goes, it's even better than new. So uh, we talk about things like the power seat that's in here, the custom gauges, the air conditioning and heat. You know, also too, if you wanted to uh, add a couple things, we can always do that to these cars. Maybe you want to add power windows to this car to finish it off. Maybe you don't care, right? Those are the things that we can do here or, or not. The, my point is this, is it just now can be yours without having to wait two or three years to restore it and cost you thirty dollars or $40,000 more. Call us, 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about this 68 Pro Touring Camaro. And I'd love to hear your comments below. Tell us about a Camaro that you rode in or tell us about uh, a friend of yours Camaro that uh, you've seen or maybe some car show pictures of a Camaro that's out there that you love as well. All right? Also, don't forget to click on the link below. It'll take you to pictures and video and some pricing on all the rest of our cars.